Every year, on January 6, the priests sanctify the waters, and those who sprinkle or bathe in the holy water are protected from evil and diseases. However, if sprinkling with holy water is allowed, it is not good to wash your head or wash your clothes, because the waters are defiled, according to popular superstitions. Bobotaza. Water has a special meaning on this day. It is said that the holy water taken has miraculous powers, thus, on Epiphany Day, no laundry is done. It is also said that it is not good to wash your head, because it pollutes the holy water. Some elders say that if you wash your head on Epiphany, you will have headaches all year. On the 6th of January, the priests sanctify the waters, and with the sanctified water people sprinkle their houses and animals. The rest of the holy water they receive from the priest when he comes with the Jordan, they keep it in bottles for the cure. Or they drink it every morning on an empty stomach. In the villages on the banks of a river, during the Epiphany service, the custom has become established that the priest throws a wooden cross into the cold, sometimes frozen water, and a few brave boys jump after it and bring it back. Epiphany is, symbolically, a celebration of the purification of nature from the forces of evil through holy water. Even now, in certain areas of the country, forecasts are being made about this year's weather conditions, whether or not they will be favorable for the harvest. Beyond the Christian customs of this day, in the Romanian tradition, some pagan purification rituals are also practiced to drive away evil spirits from households and animals. Some smoke their stables and cattle to ward off evil spirits, others light fires in the fields or sing songs accompanied by shouts and noises. According to another popular belief, when the priest puts or throws the cross into the water, the devils come out from where they were hiding and run into the field, but they cannot be seen by people, but only by wolves, who chase and tear them apart. What is not good to do on Epiphany? On the day of the baptism of the Lord, it is not good to leave clothes to dry, because the devils seek escape, hiding under them. The people also say that two weeks after Epiphany it is not recommended to wash clothes or shirts in streams, because the devils can't wait to get hold of them. Also, girls who fall on the ice on Epiphany will get married that year, according to popular belief. The holy water taken from the priest on Epiphany helps to cleanse the household of devils, vermin, snakes, fleas, diseases, but also of the influence of evil people, such as favoring rich harvests. Epiphany is an old tradition in the heart of the church. Its celebration being recorded since the 3rd century. From the very beginning it was considered, along with Easter and Christmas, one of the most important holidays in the Christian world. Every year, thousands of liters of water are sanctified by priests for the faithful who rush to take home a bottle of holy water, to protect them from diseases and evils for the coming year. Holy water is the most important element of the Epiphany celebration. The priests say about it that it is sanctified and acquires supernatural properties through the direct intervention of the Spirit or the Holy Spirit. The best argument to support the sanctity of this water is the fact that it does not change over time, keeping its qualities even for a year or two. Bobotaza. Epiphany, the secret of a giasma the secret lies, scientists say, in the fact that the respective water comes into contact with silver, by submerging the cross, and with basil, both of which have antimicrobial properties. Silver, introduced even for a short time in water, kills putrefaction bacteria and microscopic algae that are in it or creates an environment in which they cannot develop. Basil is also known to be a plant with antiseptic properties and the two, in combination, make the holy water conserve much better. Basil is also recognized for its healing qualities for certain ailments. According to natural medicine specialists, the aerial parts of the basil plant are important both in human and veterinary medicine. Its active principles act as an intestinal antiseptic, stimulate digestion, antiemetic, renal and intestinal anti-inflammatory, pulmonary antiseptic, antifungal, febrifuge. In humans, it is used in intestinal colic, intestinal bloating, vomiting, flu, cold, acute and chronic bronchitis, headaches, gastric ulcer, urinary infections, anorexia, diarrhea, etc. What does the weather foretell on Epiphany Day? The weather on Epiphany predicts, according to popular belief, that of the following year. If it rains, a long winter is ahead, and good weather predicts a good summer. If the eaves beats, it is a sign that there will be rich fruits, and if water flows from the eaves, good wine will be made. At the same time, if on Epiphany the trees are dressed in prom, there will be abundance and health. The Feast of the Epiphany is associated with the practice of rituals that often differ from one geographical area to another. After the liturgy, the priest, 
accompanied by the faithful from a specific locality, go in procession to the water's edge in that locality to sanctify the water. In the evening, hunters and foresters fire their rifles over the mirror of the water, to drive away the evil spirits, which are said to be nested in the water. The rivers, streams and lakes are now purified, and therefore women are not allowed to wash clothes in the running waters for eight days, and these waters remain holy for three to six weeks. When it is very cold, the proverbial epiphany frost, the epiphany ice cross is prepared. According to the orthodox tradition, Agasma is drunk in the morning, before breakfast, on fasting days. On holidays or at the time of illness or great distress, epiphany, the great sanctification of water. At the epiphany, the most important date was the Jordan or the great sanctification of the water. Since ancient times, in popular tradition it was said that anyone who enters the water on this day will be protected from all diseases. The sanctification of water was done in a specially arranged place near a well or running water. All the family members used to drink from the blessed holy water on this day. And a part was also added to the food of the cattle, so that they too would be healthy. And in our days, the people say that the Epiphany is the Drake of Winter, after the big traditional frost of Epiphany Day, winter is getting ready to leave. On Epiphany Day, the priests sanctify with water the people, houses and things in the household of each believer. The animals of the household are also sprinkled with holy water, sheep, pigs and oxen, animals blessed by God. Instead, do not sprinkle water over horses and rabbits, which can turn into devils. With the holy water, collected from three churches, the fields, the homemade bread and the wallet, which contains at least three new bills, are sprinkled. So that the increase is not driven out of the house by the evil thoughts of the enemies. Epiphany, the moment when the heavens open tradition says that the epiphany is the moment when the heavens open, and the guardian angel reveals to young people their luck and fortune and love. Girls who want to dream of their chosen one must steal or accept a sprig of holy basil from the priest. It is said that if they hold it in their breast or put it under their pillow before falling asleep, but also if they fast and pray to St. John on the eve of the Epiphany, they will see in their dreams the one they are destined to marry. In some areas of the country, on the eve of the Epiphany, it is said that in order to dream of their chosen one, girls must eat a cake kneaded with only nine fingers, made of eight tablespoons of flour and a tablespoon of salt, and tie a red silk thread. Then, the one they will dream of at night bringing them water is their chosen one. Black fasting is held on Epiphany Eve by tradition, black fasting, or dry day, is held on Epiphany Eve. It is said that those who manage not to eat or drink anything on this day will have luck, health and blessings from God throughout the year. After taking the agisma, holy water, from the priest, the young girls usually bathe three times in the river or pour water on their heads symbolically. As the people gathered at the banks of the Jordan, so will the suitors gather at the door of that girl. In the old days, it was customary to prepare a rich meal, similar to the one on Christmas Eve, on Epiphany Eve, with 12 dishes, kaliba, pearl barley, boiled beans, stewed plums or smoked plums, sermalas stuffed with croup, borscht specially called baba's ears, white beans with collars filled with mushrooms, fish borscht, fried fish, pies for fasting people filled with minced sauerkraut, poppy seed pies. The table was consecrated by the priest, who walked from house to house with Jordanel or Kiraleisa. There is a belief that by shouting Kiraleisa, which means God, have mercy, people gain strength, all evils flee and the year will be clean until St. Andrew, November 30th. After consecrating the table, part of the food was given to the animals in the household, so that they would be fertile and protected from diseases.